Okay, so I haven't done Libra in a few days, so maybe about a week. So, it's 12. I'm going to do Libra reading now. Alright, so, spirits. And guys, give me a few cards for Libra's energy. What's going on when dealing in Libra's energy? I'm going to use Three of Pentacles. The so Three of Pentacles is on the bottom and Will of Fortune is on top. Alright, so we're going to use those. On the bottom, we have Three of Pentacles. So somebody's stability is not the same and they need to take some rest. Uh, and on the bottom, on top, we have the chariot. So maybe someone was supposed to be coming to help you out and it didn't work out in that manner. 109. Five of Wands. Or to do something specifically and it didn't go that way. Five of Wands. Tension in the air causes arguments between the two as they wave their fists at each other. So, yeah, this is feminine energy usually. So, uh, it's a lot of fights going on with a lot of feminine energy when in your energy or around you. It's like a lot of women competition or competition dealing with women. Um, and you also have this Queen of Wands, which is another card that can be related to that. So, that's feminine energy in your life. Uh... Who could be malicious pretty much she uses her her wands or her will or the power that she has in a negative way um that's what that queen of wands energy is and yeah so that could have a lot to do with the fighting going on in your life with females and things of that nature you have a lot of wand cards you have all wand cards so it's just a lot of magical energy in your life negative and positive uh four of wands it says there will be instability through radical change as life breaks away from itself so yeah the positive i mean the upright four of wands is about things moving fast in your life and you know swift changes and good movement um steady things um but it's saying at this point with this negative side you should be patient as things are calming down calming down you know a lot of things were maybe in flux in your life it was just a lot of different energies floating around in your life and it's saying you know now they're starting to calm down a little more and you know yeah yeah all right it's starting to simmer down Simmer down. But yeah, this Queen of Wands also could be a male and feminine energy. So yeah, take it as it resonates. Um, but you definitely have a lot of fighting and scuffles and small petty fights and drama going on surrounding you, your energy. He finds the strength inside to carry on with the battle. You could be this woman in this situation dealing with a guy who has these negative feminine energies in his life and you're feeling this constant battle every time you're with him or in his energy you're feeling just battle energy like fighting energy and you could also be this male who is in this situation himself and is realizing this thing these things in his life or knows these things in his life and it's just telling you that this energy is starting to calm down more so yeah Simmer down. He finds the strength inside to carry on with the battle. So, yeah, in times of difficult situations, this card advises you to fight on and to draw from whatever resources you have left. Difficulties may dock your path for efforts, but your efforts will carry you, carry you through. So, yeah, as long as you're fighting and still going and still trying to make shit happen, then shit gonna happen. You know, it's all about your will and what you truly want. 444. It's just about what you want. You know, you know that you can bring fruition you can bring to life whatever that you truly want. You can do what you want. And it's just all about you doing that. So, yeah. Have a blessed day.